Hey guys, it's Lauren Delgado, food reporter with the Orlando Sentinel. If you're feeling a little hot, a little just crabby this summer, head on over to Red Lobster for Crab Fest. I really wanted to come here today and give you some tips and tricks on how to crack crab. It's kind of a little intimidating that maybe you don't want to do it at home, but it's really, really easy and it's actually really fun. It's something you can hit kind of all your visual or all of your senses with. You can see it, you can taste it, you can touch it, you can hear it. So we have our king crab, which is kind of like the biggest and the best of the bunch. Really, really big pieces of meat. It's very, very sweet. Then we have our snow crab here, which it's kind of like the smallest. Someone described it as the daddy, the mommy, and the baby. So this is kind of the baby of the bunch. Now my favorite, however, is bear dye crab. And this is kind of like the medium. It's slightly larger than snow crab, not quite as big as king crab, but just really, really great flavor. So how do you get into this crazy looking thing, right? Well, you need a cocktail fork and you need a crab cracker. You're just gonna pull it apart. Um, so this is your knuckle. And then this is just a little leg right here, and there's some cartilage in there, so you just pull that apart. This is kind of like my favorite part. This is like the payday, right? So you just want to kind of wiggle it back and forth a little bit. You just want to hear it crack. You don't want to break it all the way through, because otherwise you'll break the meat inside. Sometimes they're a little stubborn, but just wait for oh, it. Man. Oh, wait for it. And there you go. There is just some really, really great meat in the knuckle. So you wanna kinda of peel it apart. And again, you can see right here, there's like some really, really nice white meat. And then it's easy to just kind of get right in there and get those little nuggets out. And then last but not least, we have our, it's kind of like dessert, right? It's like the crab claw, the dessert at the end, you, you wait and wait and save for. So most importantly is you have this one um, part of the, I guess the, the pincher, right? You want to pull that out because there's a little piece of cartilage that kind of holds all of that together. And this is where your crab cracker comes in. And you just want to gently break it. They're, they're pretty strong. They're pretty tough. You want to gently break the shell. You don't want to break all the way through because then you'll break up the meat. But it should just come right out. Oh, wow. So my favorite, honestly, the best way I love crab is just some melted butter and some fresh lemon because it's just delicious. Well, I'll show you a couple of my favorite dishes. Um, again, this is our Alaska crab dinner. It's going on at Crab Fest right now at Red Lobster. It comes with our fresh uh, Chesapeake grilled corn. But if you really kind of want the trifecta of the crab, this is our crab lover's dream. So king crab legs, snow crab legs, and then our crab alfredo. So it's for a limited time. So I think that you should all come right into Red Lobster, uh, get some cracking on some crab, and we'll even do the dishes and clean up. Awesome, thank you so much. Thank you. What a fun way to celebrate this summer ingredient. Awesome, I'm so excited to be here, thank you. Cool. Thanks. Guys, I hope that made cracking open crab a little less intimidating for you. 